We are just off to the barbecue a la carte restaurant where you cook your own meats, fish and veg. It's still light, it's, we're booked for 7 o'clock and it's around 7 o'clock now. Um, John's not going to eat much, I don't think. He's, he's not touched anything to say, he feels rough. He blames it on those sexy pina coladas which were strong and you got brain freeze and you did drink quite a lot last night so let's go and see what this is like here's one of the children's play areas i'll show you a little quick look oh little trampoline over there little fly i'm afraid very good. The grass is stunning. Is this where we were last night? Yeah, mm -hmm. it's crazy the way you think the grass would be wrecked with uh, couches and bars set up and people. Yeah, it's just further up there. How gorgeous of the trees. And this is around about where we were last night. It's like nothing happened. There's a little bar area here as well. And there it is over there. Here's another quick look at the little outdoor gym. People playing tennis. A little mini golf. So here we are from the so here we are, sat right by the beach. Stunning. Did you bring this over to you? With bread to start? I don't know, I'm getting through all this. Look at the bread. Wow. So you go and choose your meat now. So we'll have a little look what meat we want. Too busy looking. So this is your choice of sausage, salmon, beef, chicken, meatballs, lamb skewers, and chicken skewers. I've gone for a meatball burger, a lamb, onion, piece of steak, piece of chicken and a piece of salmon and John's gone for that there. <laughs> so my steak's done. Well done, the way I like it. <laughs> my salmon looks like it's well done also, which 
I like it like that. I like it like that. Me salmon. Me steak is absolutely gorgeous. Really nice. What's that? Flashing. Here you get little plates of chips and nice and veg with everything. Poor oh, John, I'm making him work for it here. <laughs> Go on. Let's just take in the view. I would say that is my least favourite meal that we've had here. I know <coughs> it's nice that you get up and do it yourself, well, John has, but the steak was really, really nice. I didn't really enjoy any of the other meats. The lamb was okay, the chicken was too salty. Um, the salad and hummus and starter stuff was really nice, and the bread and the wine was nice. But yeah, definitely our least favourite. Well, it's been here, but I'm glad we tried it. It's a different experience, and as you can see, it's outside, and the view is beautiful. Be really nice when the sun's setting. So this is the Turkish barbecue at Lara Barut. We have done that one now. Like I say, my least favourite out of the restaurants we've been to, but it was something different and I feel like you can't really, well unless you have tons and tons of meat and fish, we just had one piece each really and it was just enough and they do the balclava at the end, like with a little pudding which we tried, well I tried, John never tried, and the white wine was nice. There's a mosque over there. It is a beautiful place. So I think we're actually just going to go back to the room now. John's not in any sort of mood to put a drink in his mouth. Um, I'm okay to not have a drink. It is eight o'clock, five past eight. There's a Michael Jackson tribute dance act or something on tonight. So we'll miss that. But we'll be nice and fresh for in the morning. I still can't believe how quiet it is. It is so peaceful. I wouldn't really like to come here when it was busy, busy. July, August. One of the waiters said June, July, August is really hot here and busy. So I would much prefer to come while it's like this in May or September. But this is open all year round, so you can come whenever you want. Obviously, all the restaurants aren't open in the winter and other things i'm sure the water slides and stuff aren't open because it'd be too cold but may or september would be perfect even though it's been cloudy while we've been here i think it's a little bit of a freaky weather there's a cat after a bird up a tree <laughs> don't think you've got a chance you're miles away, cat. <laughs> oh. oh, it's just playing, isn't it? It's only a kitten. Yeah, I don't know, but it's, it's, it's a good little game for it. And one day I'm sure it'll get one. <laughs> Here's the 
these small little kitties. Hello. Hello, pussy cats. Lovely then, isn't it? Yeah. We need to find this cat house. So we nearly forgot then. I need to go and check out the main restaurant for you. It is Thursday night and tonight Matthew, I think it is Italian night, which would have been John's favourite night. So let's see what pastas and pizzas they have on tonight. Fish, tuna, meat, <laughs> as usual. All your dips and hummus. This is all the normal which they have every night. Lots more fish options here. Here are some mussels. Smoked salmon. Pumpkin risotto, seafood, pasta with mushroom sauce, tagatelli. Ravioli and spaghetti bolognese and there's a big piece of meat over there we'll have a look let's just go to the desserts again dessert trees and we've not tried any of them. Mm, that looks nice doesn't it? I don't know what it is but it looks nice. But we are stuffed. That also looks amazing. So yeah. Oh my god tiramisu. Wow. Look at those tiramisu guys. Tiramisu. special little cakes there, all the ice cream is there, then you've got your fold in this area next to that. And let's go and have a little look in the bakery grill. That's the matching couple guys. They wear the same stuff all the time. So it's pizzas down here. Pizzas, beetroot, potato. Rafa bland ribs, grilled quail, beef medallions, duck legs, grilled sea bass and grilled white grouper. Yep. So we're going to see what this big piece, piece of um, meat is down here. Not John. <laughs> Not you. <laughs> There's my nails again guys. She doesn't want a cake job. <laughs> There's your vegan option, options. Oh, what's that? Lamb shank. So that is our lamb shank. And this is take a lasagna. And that is baked beef. It's a big piece of beef. 
And that is that lasagna, there's your lasagna there. <laughs> sat down and I have got a creme brulee with some um, vanilla ice cream, a nice glass of white wine and John's tried to have a little cake over there. This is like a, a baked, I don't know, I don't know what it is, and it's this stuff, this looks amazing, it's got like all nuts in, let's taste. Oh yeah, that's like a, a nut pudding, shall I say. Creme brulee, brulee is insane. It's so nice, and so is that pudding. This pudding thing, shred of vanilla ice cream. Very nice. Yeah, this is like a soaked. I don't know. It's good. And the creme brulee is amazing. Wow, this place is so good. It's a lot warmer today, even the sea. It's still not clear blue skies because you'd be able to see those mountains over there, which look stunning, but you can just about see them because it's very misty. About. But it's nice and warm today. The sea seems a little bit choppy today as well. It's usually a lot calmer. White building you can see over there is the Titanic looks, and then next to that here is called the Cosmopolitan, and then it's our hotel. If you only walk right outside, and you go down there, obviously, you come down to the shops. But I don't know how it works with the all inclusive because I think they have like staff stands, stands at each end of the beach. So when you get to the end of our part of the beach, you must check to see if you can go further. Because obviously people will be walking into each other's hotels if you didn't do that. Also, what else have you got to say? Oh yeah, I thought I got away with the mosquitoes. And I've got one on me foot. So I must have got bit last night. So there's mosquitoes around. It's on me back, but I can't check yet. Yeah, I must be so by so I just thought a bit of sunburn. There's a plane taking off there. It is busy here yeah, today because it's quite close to the airport. You can see planes coming in and out all day long. As you can see, it's stony, and I definitely recommend bringing some sort of a swim shoe with you and the sand is boiling hot today so definitely some sort of sand or even to get to the water or if not a swim shoe especially for children because it's so hot the sand and if you stone do hurt <laughs>
little look at what we want. We need to pick a drink first. There's the QR code there as well, so that's really good because you can check all your drinks and everything else that's on there. I'll have a little look. Chicken bowl with basmati rice, pineapple, and garden greens. Here is my chicken pineapple salad. Just looks like a bit of chicken with rice. And there's John's. Looks nice. So we've just came out of sandals for lunch. <coughs> my little rice bowl. Oh, yeah, it was okay. Just a bit of chicken with pineapple and rice. Um, quite filling actually for the little bowl and John's, John's cuisines and fries were nice the sun's gone in again the clouds are out but it is very warm today This is one of the children's play areas. So you've got your table tennis, your air hockey, little all-star basketball. area to play games. Perfect. Yeah. Another small children's area by the main restaurant. This is one of our favourite places. The little K bar. It's got some lovely artwork up. It's always quiet and the ornaments are beautiful. I've ordered an espresso martini to take up to the room with me. I've not tried one of them here yet. There's the piano over there. They have different nights on here every night. Piano guy, a trumpet guy, a singer. It's really nice. There's a little library. And it's always quite peaceful. I'm sure it gets busier once the summer starts arriving. So here goes for my espresso martini. Have a try. Mm, um, no, it's just a nice coffee, really. <laughs> Look at this over here. That's a little silly, isn't it? Fast and the Furious take down. I don't know whether that's a nice role for now for kids to play. Here's the daily darts. The grass is so soft and spongy, it doesn't even feel real, but it actually is real because I've seen people cutting it and there's little mushrooms growing out here and there. I don't think we've ever seen anyone come down these water slides 
Maybe it's not warm enough. I think that's Bocca or something it's called over there and there's one of the little buggies which take you around. I've not been on one. But my friends I know who's here said they jumped on one this morning from the cat house up to the beach and it was brilliant. So I am off to the bar in the beach, beach bar. Don't know what's on today. I think it's um, the singer Vicky. Not me now. The ladies call Vicky. Also, it looks there uh, wheelchair friendly because there's quite a few people I've seen in wheelchairs and it's easy for them to get round, which is great news.